I'm Luz Maria Martinez. I work in the Technical University of Muni. I research scientist in the project of Rosmosis. And I do my PhD in robotics and my bachelor in computer science. And robotics is about these composable models uh, for software and tools to improve the robotics project, the quality, and reduce the complexity of the project and help to the developers to reduce the time of development. Well, we have two tools. One of them is Smart MDSD and the other one is Papyrus for Robotics. Both of them offer a lot of uh, sections to improve the development. Uh, Papyrus for Robotics offer uh, safety and performance monitoring. Um, Smart MDSD offers software, open source software for different robotics projects. Yeah, I think it's really important because it's mostly robotics and robotics is a field very uh, that changes very fast in time. So a lot in software and robotics. So we can see a lot of software all years and a lot of stuff that are working. So mainly in research, I think it's really important the open source because it, it allows to the people to make experiments and compare their research with another research more easily. Eclipse is a good example of a huge community in, in open source. And we can see a lot of developers in, in interesting interest in a number of fields. In one of them, maybe they are interested in robotics, computer vision, or machine learning. So I can show them the tools that they will improve their works. And if they are working in another field, they, I can show them the model, model driven engineer that can be useful also for their projects. Well, in three years, uh, we already have a Eclipse working group, I suppose. Um, I, uh, the two partners that are working in the tools will be included in this working group, and also the tools, the project that we funded in the first part of the project will be included in this part of the working group. Also, the two tools that are already in a solid base, but they will continue working for a long time, and they will. Papyrus will improve the part of the safety and performance and monitoring and code generation. And Smart DSD, I suppose they will include more robots and more software for uh, have more behaviors available.